wants to play. She like did that little jumpy around thing. And Daniel's not sure what to make of it. She wants to play so bad. Luna, come on, let's go. Simon, you keep ruining it. Luna's trying to get him to play. Hello guys, I'm going out for lunch. <coughs> I have this cough, won't go away. I'm going out for lunch with my dad. We're gonna go to the place that we usually go to, Maki Maki, in, it's just, just off of White Ave in Edmonton. If you haven't been there and you like Vietnamese food, their pho is fucking amazing. What a good joke, wow. Oh God, I need to like take this jacket off because I pulled it out of the uh, front closet and this is one of those ones that just kind of smells like dog now because all of the dog stuff is kept in the front closet. Thankfully, I have a bunch of clothes that I'm bringing to Plato's closet again and I have a cardigan that I just threw in there that I was like, eh, I don't know, we'll see if they want to take it and now they don't get the option because I want it to wear right now and putting on clothes while you're driving is difficult so that's pretty sweet so I got this shirt that I'm wearing right now from ThreadUp and I got a lot of the clothes <coughs> that I'm donating from ThreadUp too I mean I kept a lot of them but there's probably like five or six pieces that just didn't end up working out so I'm gonna bring those in and I don't know like I really like buying from there because it's like a fun process but I feel like I just need to start going to actual thrift stores because that's where I found some of my favorite pieces recently I went to um, what is it not Salvation Army the other one whatever the other one is and um, I found a lot of good pieces so I got a couple cardigans I think I put it all in a haul video but it was some cute shit I did, I put it all in like my thread up try on haul or giant try on haul or whatever. So enjoyed that. I don't know, these days where I like get out of the house really early and me and Andrew were talking about this too. I just feel like a little bit more inspired to do more stuff out of the house. All right guys, so it is three o'clock. It is Thursday today. And um, I spent the night over at Steph's with uh, Jackson and my rover dog and then came home did such a thorough clean so thorough I mopped upstairs and oh actually there's another entrance I can do so oof. I mopped upstairs and downstairs and I did so much laundry and I worked out and I made like a breakfast smoothie and now I'm gonna run a bunch of errands oh I also edited a video and it's been a very productive early portion of the day, but I wanna to go to the liquor store. I need to mail something out. I want to pick up a couple of things that I need from the drug store. So I need like pads and panty liners because hi, bleeding because of my IUD. As many clothing that he wanted. He could have had my slippers. He could have had whatever the fuck he wanted. So this is the boy that's now leaving because I'll show you in a second. This is Daniel. You guys have seen him in videos before. He's going to a new foster family today because I walked downstairs yesterday and I see that he has chewed up the carpet, ripped off the baseboards. So he going to different place now. It was quite a day yesterday. Was it day full of crying? Uh... So much crying. But I met someone at Sephora. That was nice. I'll insert the picture right here. Thanks for saying hi. Oh. So we're doing a games night tonight, and this is my version of a charcuterie board. <laughs> because these are all of the leftovers that we had to get rid of. And then I made chickpeas and I'm making kale chips and we're playing games tonight. And Daniel is going to his new foster home tonight because as I have showed you, that happened last night. So 
I go downstairs yesterday to let him out. He's in his kennel for literally max three hours from when Jess leaves to the time that I get up and like want to come downstairs with all the dogs. So, oh my God, I go downstairs. He had broken out of his kennel. He had destroyed the carpet, ripped it up. What you saw yesterday, like I'll insert pictures, but what you saw, not yesterday, when I showed that is me having like cut it because it was like splayed out and there were rips everywhere. It was just gross and ripped off the, the door trim. Just really doing the most. Tato, that's not actually your food. Thank you so much. <laughs> no. So just went out yesterday, bought trim and she's gonna get like a little area rug to cover that. And then when she's moving out, she's gonna buy a new carpet. Holy fuck, holy fuck. I cried and then Jeff came home from work and we're so anxious. We all had to cry last night. So now we need to drink and play games. Here's what we got. We went to West Dad and got these today. And this is what we already have. So I'm sure we can make life into a drinking game, you know, like drink however many things you spin. All right, guys, I have just brought in my taxes and I came home and I steam clean carpets and I filmed and now, Although it is February 2nd, I am allowing myself one order of like food delivery for the next three months per month. And I didn't do anything in January, so this one counts for January, okay? Is that cheating? Yes. Do I care? Yes. Am I still doing it because I'm hungry and I'm tired and I've worked a lot today and I've done a lot of stuff and I just brought in taxes and that's always a sad time because I never get fucking refunds I always have to pay yes it's sad so <laughs> also it's Super Bowl Sunday and I couldn't care less but anyways that's that do you hear that silence because there's no other dogs here except for Jack and then there's Finny and there's Tato and that is the team that's the team in this house now see we've got Finny being a hygienic boy we've got Tato being a sleepy lady and in here, we've got Jack being the best. Hi, okay, so I wanted to close out this video, but I also wanted to say that um, the basement stuff, real bad. I mean like bad because no one wants to like walk downstairs and see a bunch of damage, but Daniel is still a good dog and he's still gonna make a great companion. He just has a lot of anxiety and didn't enjoy being kenneled so he's in a good foster home right now and he's still gonna be up for adoption just have to work on a couple of those personality things and get him a little bit more confident but I just wasn't willing to have to have just shell out a ton of money or have more things ruined so it was just the best option because that's a lot of extensive damage like the the rescue we sent them pictures and they were even like oh my god right like so I don't know. I don't want anyone to think that like he's going to have a shitty life now. He's still going to have a great life and um, he's still going to get adopted and he's still a good boy, but just really fucked up my basement. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that was that. And then we went to West Ed and we got games, those two games that I showed you. Let me just scroll back because one of them was really fun. The For the Girls one was really fun and you can use that as a drinking game with a bunch of people. The Buzzed game, Cooper and I played that while everyone else was out or like getting more games or whatever. And it was so boring. It was so boring. I wouldn't buy that game. But uh, Cards Against Humanity was also fun. We didn't end up playing Life, but then uh, we went upstairs and watched a little bit of Harry Potter 2 because I'm trying to get him through the Harry Potter movies because he's never seen them for some stupid reason. And uh, he's going to be a real person soon. Very excited about it. But that is it. Hopefully you will meet Cooper sometime soon because he's a great guy. And um, I don't know. I'll just I'll see you guys soon. I've been liking posting here a lot more. And I want to go see some more horror movies so I can get you guys some more reviews. But I also want to do more commentaries because I haven't done one in a couple months. So let me know if you have a movie you want me to do a commentary on. I love you guys very much and I will see you very soon. Bye.